green to red. Um, yeah, it's uh, actually this is going to have to be my Jackson. 15 quid I think that cost me. Perfect fit. Perfect. I've just been looking at my videos, my video manager and what have you. Oh yeah, I'm on this stuff again. Galahad. Let's see if I get a bit of a... Any fizz in there? Fizz isn't it? Dies down. Look at that. There's a little bit of it in there. It's okay, so 2.15, that's all it is. So yeah, I've been looking at my video manager and I've done a flat cap, let's get that the other way around, and a cold one since last Saturday. I've done one Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. So I'm going to do one every day of this week until next Saturday, I think. Why not, innit? Um, yeah, I thought sod it. So yeah, it's a flat cap and a cold one all week. So this is the Wednesday episode, and if you've been following them, just turn it that way a bit. Um, yeah, I had my guns checked. Um, he was here. What time was he here? About five o'clock, and that was his last call. Busy, he was saying he's had a busy, it's, it's, it's absolutely crazy, he's very, very busy. All he deals with is, you know, the firearms, look at that, nothing on it at all, but I like it. You don't get much of a frothy head anyway on lager, but this stuff, sometimes it's okay. Oh, it's a bit gassy, it is very gassy, but, oh, God. Excuse me, excuse me. Oh God. <laughs> um, yeah, he said um, it's, it's absolutely crazy. And six weeks it was. I was asking him. I wasn't sure where, where you put the um, the application in. You know, for either. Well, not for a, a renewal. I don't know so much about an application for the grant. You know, your first certificate. But I've just been renewing. <coughs> And he says it's six weeks. That's the North Wales Police. They quote six weeks. You've got to put it in before that. And he just checked the guns, checked the cabinet. Just had a bit of a chat. Less than five minutes and shake of hands. And he was away. He was, uh, yeah, you know, no, no hassle, nothing. All of it bored. And he was gone. So yeah. Uh, so that's my guns all checked and everything, and yeah, it's all it's all cool. All you know, that's me for another well six and a half years now. It's every seven years it is or something where they uh, you have to renew, apply for renewal. And I put the video on my other channel, the gun. I've just edited a few bits and pieces out and on all that. But it's on my Gunner 17722 channel. So if you've watched it on this channel and, and you subscribe, because I know a lot of you subscribe to this channel and my Gunner channel. So if you see that video or certain other videos, it's very rarely I will do a video on this channel and put it on my Gunner because they're two totally separate channels. But this. You know, I had a question on this channel and I replied to it and I thought it's a good idea to put that video because it relates to the Gunner channel. So it's on that channel. So if you've watched it on this channel, don't watch it on the other channel. God, <laughs> if, you, if you've worked that out. So, uh, popping out tomorrow to Tesco. A few essentials. Not this stuff. Well, I, I shouldn't condemn it. It's only two fifteen, but get a few more essentials. Get some more left. I've already got one. I was in prostatin 
the other day and I went to the coast, filmed the, the oh the sea, bloody hell, I don't like the sea, do not like it at all. I don't mind standing on the shore and watching it but I would not want to be out there on a boat. I can climb mountains, <coughs> I can walk to a cliff edge, it could be a few hundred feet drop and I can look, look over, it doesn't bother me at all. But I look out to the sea and I think, no way. I would not want to be out there on a boat. It did. It gives me the creeps. And yet, on the other hand, saying that, these um, well, paranormal experiences that I get, they don't bother me at all. It's strange, isn't it? And I will be doing another, I'll call in that abandoned house. Because <laughs> I did a GoPro. Because I wasn't expecting, um, you know, I didn't know what I was going to expect to find, I should say. Um, I haven't said what I was going to go to Tesco for, was it? That's, that's the trouble with me, I wonder. I start talking about something, then I start talking about something else. Then I forgot what I originally started talking about. It's all good fun, isn't it? That's a flat cap and a cold one for you. So yeah, what was that? Right, I'll finish about the um, the house. I'll call in there again, and I'll use a video camera because, um, well, camcorder I should say with sound. I'll do a bit of a voiceover and a bit of a narrative or narrative or whatever you call it. Because I just used a GoPro, you know, with um, no no talking and this and that. But it's a creepy old place. Uh, there's no roof on it. But them sofas, I'm sure there was three sofas, or, or, or two sofas and a chair. And it was a jar of silver spoon. I don't know what the hell it was. <laughs> silver spoon something. But uh, it, I, it, there's a creepy atmosphere in there. Very, very eerie. Like, like there's a presence. I can I sense things like that. Um, and I thought, any minute now there's someone going to just poked the head round that there was someone in that house with me, put it that way. It was very, very eerie, very, very creepy. But it didn't make me think, oh God, and, and run out, because you just sort of get used to it. I'm just there thinking, well, well come on, you know, if you if you get, if you're round this corner, and I went round the corner, oh, this stuff, <coughs> ooh, you know, if you're going to be there, you know, I'm going to see you and say hello and shake your hand or what have you you know just I was just expecting to see something what I was expecting to see I don't know but there was something there with me anyway and watching me so I'm going to return <laughs> the place I don't like is Holkin Cemetery no that's a no no I'm not going to return to there ever again I don't think I hate that place I do not like that place I feel ill physically drains me and there's something in that place that does not like me and I have done a few videos on it just check out Hulkin Cemetery on this channel there and you'll see my face turns grey and I come out I start sweating then I go cold and that is a horrible place and I felt I was going to I thought I was going to faint and this and that is really there's something that that place is evil that's the only word I could describe about Holkin Cemetery it's evil but I'm going to return to this uh, this this house I've walked past it many a time but um yeah I'm gonna right I'm gonna get back to Tesco now <laughs> um, I'm gonna get some um, I bought some eggs from farm foods box of pack of 15 I think beautiful eggs and I hadn't used them so what we're going to do is is make a load of um, egg and cress I love egg and cress my favorite um, my favorite sandwiches or butties as we call them um, are tuna and mayonnaise Bit of sweet corn thrown in, um, ham and tomato, and 
Egg and Cress. Those are my three favourite butties, shall we say, or, or sam sandwiches. But we, we, in the UK we say butties. Um, so I'm going to go to uh, Tesco, get some essentials. Um, and get some cress and some solid cream. Just uh, chop the egg, put half a punnet of cress with the egg, dash of solid cream just to bind it together, slice of bread, butter or margarine or spread. I, I'm using um, utterly butterly at the moment. Put the mix on, the other slice on top, in half, that's it. You got a cracking egg and cress butty. So yeah, I'm going to do, so this is the Wednesday supplement of the, gap, a cold one. So if you bothered watching, yeah, I'm going to do one, I didn't realise, I didn't realise I've done one every day of the week since last Saturday. So I'm going to go from the Saturday to the Saturday. It's going to be a flat cap and a cold one. Or, as someone has commented when I had this stuff, it's a flat cold one and a, and a flat cap and they're not, not, they're not wrong. But I like it. Um, Morrisons have dropped their price of cowling. Uh, 12, no not Carlin, sorry, Carlsberg, I'm sure they have, it's a 12 quid for 18, but Aldi um, are 11 for 20, you've got to shop around. You know, look after the pennies and the pounds and look after themselves or whatever, some, some sort of saying isn't it, you've got to watch the pennies. So, anyway, obviously, basically, that'll be the end of this Wednesday uh, flat cap and a cold one. So, yeah, like I say, I'm going to do a Thursday, a Friday, and a Saturday. And why not, innit? See you in the next one.